So we've got a UNVR here, which is uh, showing a very fast white flashing light and non-responsive on the network. So we need to remove the cover, so there's two screws on the side here. Uh, just pointing out, if when you take off this screw, you are breaking the seal, so the warranty is gone, which is there as well, so it's three on the back, and then we've got two on the side, here and here. And then it's just a case of uh, pulling the cover back, and then that slides off quite nicely. And inside, you can see the uh, USB memory stick, which is used to store bits and bobs, and that's what essentially what has failed in this case. So we need to replace that, which is quite easy. Now I just removed the uh, fan connector just to make life a bit easy, and then gently score down the side to try and break the sill on the hot glue, which is holding the uh, memory stick in place there. Of course, being careful not to uh, scratch too hard. And then uh, I just used a screwdriver by very light pressure just to break that sill a little bit more. Just do it equally on both sides. Obviously not doing too much pressure because you don't want to break any of the components further up the line there. And eventually it should break through and then it should pop out, like so. Now I've just got a standard 8 gig um, USB stick here. I uh, formatted it with FAT32 and that just slots in there quite nicely. And then you just uh, put the uh, fan connector back in and then uh, plug it into the network, um, power it up and then you'll get the sort of steady white light initially, which will then go to a sort of blinking white light. And that'll flash away for about uh, 10 minutes or so, so you just leave it alone, get yourself a cup of tea or something. And eventually you should get a steady white light, which basically means it's saying it's ready to adopt and ready to configure. So you go to the IP address, as you can see on this one here. It's ready to go, ready to set up. And uh, we bought this device from the dead.